Hello, I'm going to do the Capricorn and Cancer sign love reading. Connection reading. So this could be a friend, a family member. It could be a partnership. This may or may not resonate with you. If it does, take the parts that do resonate. If it does not, leave the parts that do not resonate as those may be meant for someone else. Okay, so I have my Romance Angel cards. I have my Angel Answers cards. I have my Whispers of Love. And I have my Heart-Shaped Romance cards. So we're going to see what's going on between... I feel like that one. Capricorn and Cancer. So we have passion. What's going on between Capricorn and ca uh, Cancer sign? All right, we have not the right time. Whispers of love. What's going on between Capricorn and Cancer sign? We have slow down, pause, and allow things to unfold. Okay. So passion could be something that is lacking in your relationship. All right, so let's get a heart-shaped. I kind of feel like this one here. Freedom. There is nothing stopping you. The path is clear if you want it to be. I feel like the two of you are kind of struggling right now. I feel like there's a lack of passion. I feel that, let's see, where can I put this one? I guess we could just put it there. So we, ha because I feel like there's a lack of passion. I feel like there's some distance between the two of you. I feel like one of you is maybe wanting freedom. I feel like maybe one, I f maybe one of you is rushing. And I just feel that there's a good disconnect between the two of you. I just feel like there's definitely a disconnect between the two of you. So let's see what's going on with Cancer Sign. What is going on with Cancer Sign with Capricorn? What is going on with Cancer Sign with Capricorn? All right, so we have the Page of Swords. We have the Four of Swords. Yeah, I feel Cancer Sign is overwhelmed because Knight of Swords can represent scattered energy. It could be that you're all over the place, like very, um, I feel like Four of Swords represents that you want to take a break. Um, I also feel that with Seven of Cups, that could be energy that is overwhelming. I feel like Cancer Sign has a lot on their mind. What else is going on here with Cancer Sign? Is there anything else for Cancer Sign? I, I don't feel like there's anything else. I feel like Cancer Sign is all over the place. I feel like they're not sure what's going on. I feel like they have a lot on their mind. Um, slow down, I feel like represents the Cancer Sign especially with the Four of Swords. Um, let's see, what what's going on with Capricorn? Capricorn. I feel like these three here, we have the Sun, we have the Five of Wands, and we have the Star card. I feel like Capricorn's going back and forth too. There might be a lot of arguments between the two of you. There might be a lot of disconnect. There might be a lot of not seeing eye to eye. I feel like I feel like Capricorn, like you're kind of lost your way, like you've lost your path within this relationship. Um, I feel almost feel like Cancer sign is kind of taken on an air sign energy where they're sort of all over the place. Um, cancer sign can also be very emotional. They can be up and down. They can be kind of aloof. Um, like I'm thinking of the king of, of cups. Like he's somebody who's very aloof. Sometimes he's not putting enough effort in, right? Sometimes that happens. But I just feel maybe Capricorn feels that cancer isn't putting enough effort in Because maybe Cancer Sign is feeling rather aloof. 
I just feel like there's not a focus here between the two of you. I feel like you're kind of, you're both in your corner. Okay, so what else do we have for Cancer sign? All right, what else do we have for Cancer sign? What else do we have for Cancer sign? Okay, so we got the Eight of Cups, we got the Ace of Pentacles, and we have the Six of Wands. I feel that in order for things to get back on track, I feel that there are some things that maybe have been on Cancer's mind, and maybe there's something that can't the Cancer sign needs to speak up about and that they need to talk about and they need to acknowledge and they need to communicate to Capricorn. It could be that Cancer is feeling that they want to walk away from this relationship, but it also could be that Cancer sign is holding on to things that are affecting the relationship and that the Cancer sign has to focus more on the positive. I just feel like there's some emotions or feelings um, that are bothering the Cancer sign. We have that progression, we have the seven and then the eight of cups, so it's like being overwhelmed with something and then sort of taking that time to sort through what it is that's overwhelming you and then being able to leave behind what's not working but focus towards what is working because it's walking towards the sun. We have the ace of pentacles and I feel like this could have to do something with your job, um, a career or work or a job could be affecting the two of you, like maybe somebody's working a lot or somebody's not working enough, or maybe it has to do with money. Definitely when there are money problems within a relationship, that can cause a lot of stress in a relationship. Um, and that could be what is happening. Pentacles can also represent the physical, and I feel like the physical goes back with the passion. Are the two of you being physical? Are the two of you connecting? It doesn't have to, it could mean just holding hands. It could be just touching that person or being near that person or having that physical connection. Does Cancer sign, is that one of their five love languages? Is that something that is important to them? Or is it one of Capricorns? I kind of feel like it's more for Cancer sign and this ca cancer is part of a relationship for the cancer sign, having that physical connection between the two of you. And is that what's lacking? And is that what needs to be focused on, right? I feel like it's kind of finding those weak spots within your relationship and focusing on those things and seeing, okay, is it the money? Is it career? Is it, there's not enough physical, like, is that a love language for cancer sign that Capricorn isn't giving, right? Um, I feel like it's sort of, a lot of things that the two of you need to figure out. I love this one because we have the Six of Wands, which represents success and victory and getting past this situation. So I kind of feel like Cancer Sign wants to move past this and wants to work on this, but I feel like it's kind of pinpointing what the problems are. All right, for Capricorn, what do we have going on here for Capricorn? We have the Page of Swords. What else do we have going on here for Capricorn? The Sun card. Look, the Capricorn has Sun card twice. I love it. Positive energy. What else do we have here for Capricorn between Capricorn and Cancer sign? What else do we have going on here? Okay. Feel like one more and the emperor i feel like it's being powerful in this situation i when i saw this sun card I, like i said it's walking away from this but heading towards the sun card and capricorn has the sun card so that's why i feel like it's cancer sign is working walking towards capricorn because capricorn has the sun card over here I feel like Capricorn wants to work things out. I feel like you need to step out of the shadows. I feel like you need to step up front. I feel like you you need to get in back into your power. I feel like you need to speak up, but I feel like you also have to be careful to not be too controlling, right? I feel like there's a way to be up front and there's a way to 
get your point across, but it's also about not being overbearing and f and if cancer sign feels like like they're not being heard. I feel like there's a lot about communication with the page of swords that can represent um a new way of analyzing and looking at things. Like I said, what are the love languages? What are the top things that cancer needs? Do they need more physical touch, right? Do they need more of that connection? And is that something that Capricorn is like, oh, okay. Well, maybe that's something that I need to work on and I need to make more effort for that. Also, it's about what are Capricorns, you know, what does Capricorn need? And is cancer fulfilling those needs? But are the two of you even, do you even know what those are and have you communicated to each other or, or are you just assuming that person should know? I feel like it's sort of unfair to assume that. I feel like communication is so important to get that across. Maybe when you first met it was one thing, but maybe it's changed. So you need to re-communicate that or you need to reinforce that. I do feel that the two of you are going to be able to work this out, but I feel like it has to do a lot with figuring out what your own needs are, figuring out what it is that you need from the other person, and then also being able to communicate. I feel like with this slow down, pause, and allow things to unfold, I feel like that's what you need to happen is kind of slow things down. Let's figure these things out and let's work this out together. And having that mindset is what's going to make this relationship work and get it back on track. I feel like there's definitely possibility there. I don't feel like this Eight of Cups is Cancer Sign wanting to walk away. It could be that maybe Cancer Sign wants to take a temporary break or kind of have their own space to clear their thoughts. Um, it could just be like a weekend getaway or it could just be a few hours or it's going off and doing something that they enjoy doing, like if they like you know, since the cancer sign and the water sign, like if they like to go boating or something and they spend the day boating or something and for them to clear their mind. So it could be something like that. But like I said, it's definitely about communication, but you have to figure out what it is that you want first before you can communicate to the other person. All right, so let's grab a um, energy oracle for this reading to close it out. For Cancer and Capricorn, we have the world. The world is yours. It's yours to take, but you have to work on it, right? Again, it's like this person is going to the end of the dock and they're around the water and they have the lotus flowers here. So I feel like what does the world represent to each of you? And it also can, like I was saying, does Cancer sign need to take that break? Like, where do you see this going? What do you see happening? And what is being honest about what is that energy or effort that you can put into this relationship and being true to that. And then let's get a wisdom of the oracle. We have here and now. Being in the present, right? I feel like it's not bringing up things from the past or not pushing towards the future. Realizing where you want to go, but not. But I feel like it's here and now to fix what's going on here and now. And I feel like that goes with the slow down. Pause and allow things to unfold here and now. We have the past and we have the future and she's right here in the middle. Um, you are here. Is That's what it says on this flag. You're in this moment here. right? Are there things that need to be discussed from the past? Are there things that need to be discussed in the future? Yes. But what is where is the current situation of what you're feeling right now? And what is, it need, what is it that you need right now for this relationship? All right. Thank you so much for watching. As always, stay positive, stay safe, and I will see you next time.